This week in 1860, the oldest known recording of an audible human voice was made on the phonograph machine by its French inventor. This week in 1892, voters in Lockport, New York became the first in the U.S. to use voting machines. In 1894 this week, the kinetoscope was demonstrated by its inventor Thomas Edison in New York City. A viewer that held 50 feet of film, about 13 seconds worth, showed images of Annie Oakley and Buffalo Bill. In 1956 this week, Ampex Corporation of Redwood City, California demonstrated the first commercial magnetic tape recorder for sound and picture. The videotape machine had a price tag of $75,000 and these early Ampex units were too large to fit in a small room. This week in 1976, Apple's first product ever, the Apple One computer, was created by co-founder Steve Wozniak. And this week in 1984, Challenger astronauts made the first satellite repair in orbit by returning a healthy SolarMax satellite to space. The orbiting SunWatcher had been circling the Earth for three years with all circuits dead before repairs were made. That's our look back at This Week in Tech History brought to you by IFA in Berlin. IFA, the Global Innovations Show. 6,000 media representatives, 2,600 from abroad. It's IFA time. Meet the official partner of the future in Berlin. Don't forget to check out our website anytime at intotomorrow.com and subscribe to our free podcasts while you're there. We'll catch you next time on This Week in Tech History.